Bilkis Bano's rapist have shared stage reportedly with a Gujarat BJP MP and an MLA. Now that has led to a massive war of words with the TMC attacking uh, the BJP over the same. Mahua Mitra took to Twitter where she has hit out uh, at the BJP claiming and she said and I quote that I want to see these monsters back in jail and I want to see the key thrown away. I want this satanic government uh, that applauds this travesty of justice out on court. This was the statement by Mahua Mohit. Many reactions also coming in. Let's listen in. BJP is time and again emphasizing that it has great respect for law and justice and uh, holds the administration of justice in high esteem. Now, this picture of convicts of Bilki's case suddenly appearing uh, on the stage uh, as though the convicts who are the beneficiaries of uh, premature release are having full blessings and protections of BJP. Now, whilst the matter is under examination by the Honorable Supreme Court, this kind of exposure is only an indication of an unsuccessful attempt on the part of BJP to influence the administration of justice. All right, my colleague Mohit Bhatt is joining us live on the broadcast. He has more details on the same. Mohit, a massive war of words is now broken out between the BJP and the opposition. Uh, till now, of course, we have TMC leaders who are attacking the BJP uh, over this picture which has now emanated where one can reportedly and purportedly see Gujarat BJP's MLAs and an MP sharing stage uh, with Bilkis Banos convicts. Well, yes, and these are the shocking images that have surfaced and which has garnered criticism from various opposition parties. Now, Gujarat MP and his brother, who is also the MLA from the same area, was seen uh, sharing stage with one of the convicts uh, in the in the Bilkis Bano case. Though we know for a fact that how uh, last year on the Independence Day, uh, 11 convicts were being released. A panel was being formed by the Gujarat government. Now, it was being alleged that many of them, members of that panel, had some BJP link. And on account of so-called good behavior, they all were being released and at that time also we saw that how the opposition parties came out and basically stated that this is travesty of justice, this should have not been done. A strong message should have sent out to all those rapists who raped Bilkis Banu, who killed her uh, daughter and hence we know also for a fact that these pictures have emerged just the day before uh, uh, when the Supreme Court today will be hearing the Bilkis Banu case, the petitions for the review that have been filed by TMC MP Mahua Mitra, Bilkis Banu herself, Suhasini Ali and National Federation for Women. So all these petitions will come up in the Supreme Court, but these pictures have given opposition a, a, a sort of ammunition to attack the BJP, saying that somebody who is an uh, who is an accused and who has been a convict of such a ghastly crime, such a horrific crime, is being seen sharing stage with the BJP MP and the MLAs. Though nothing official on record has come from the BJP MLA and the BJP MP who has seen the stage, he will surely be coming to the Parliament, and our team will be trying to get his reaction on this but when a convict in such a uh, such a such a shocking case shares state with the politicians it gives out a very wrong message to the people on the ground and hence we see that the opposition parties are attacking the bjp saying that the bjp is sharing state with somebody who has been who has been convicted of bilkis Bano case and the review petition is also pending in the supreme court which is likely to come today and hence it has created a massive controversy so we have to wait and watch what exactly the bjp will have to say but yes opposition Opposition surely is mounting pressure on the BJP and attacking the BJP saying that the rapists are being shielded by the Gujarat government.